Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen, baby. Today is game day for the Las Cruces Bulldogs, and they're all about business. Business trip starts now. I right, put on the side of the bus. Dirty South business trip. All right, start getting locked in. We'll put the movie on. Make sure you understand what it's all about. Coach Lopez wants his players to be focused on the task at hand. After all, they're playing the team that eliminated them from the playoffs last season. Hey, you want to sleep on us? Hey, we'll wake them up. Focused they are. They've waited nine long months to avenge their semifinal loss to the El Dorado Eagles. This time they have a new quarterback and a new head coach. But one thing remains the same, their intensity. As the team stretches, coaches go over final details with the players and make sure they're locked in. PFE, give me six seconds at a time. Six seconds at a time, PFE. Everything you're doing now. Hey. You got some pretty good music. Hey. That's really good. heard a lot of work. Hey. 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 Coach Lopez may dream of rock star hair, but it's time now for the captains alongside Bulldog Superfan to line up and take the field for the coin toss. El Dorado wins the toss and elects to receive. The team shake hands and head south, to the locker room. I tell you what, man, what an incredible opportunity to be here with you guys. Thank you guys for the and be able to go out there tonight wearing those colors and that dog's on the front of your jersey, man. Where else would you rather be? Nowhere else. Nowhere else. Nowhere else. Nowhere else. Nowhere else. Both teams are set to kick off the 2016 season. One minute and 14 seconds later, the Eagles quarterback, Matt Dennis, would run the ball 40 yards for the score. The dogs would fight their way to the red zone behind big runs by senior running back, Ryan Beltran. Junior quarterback, Peyton Ball, would find his way into the end zone to tie the game at seven. After another Eagle score, Ball would find junior Brandon Baeza in the corner of the end zone to once again tie the game. But not everything went right for Ball in his first start the quarterback. After a turnover, El Dorado would capitalize with a field goal to once again take the lead 17-14. Ivan Molina would take the ensuing kickoff 93 yards to give the Dogs their first lead of the game, 21-17. Although the Eagles would once again take the lead, Las Cruces would find success through the air with a big 35-yard catch from Baeza. Ball would once again find the end zone, but this time to senior Gabe Casada to put them up 28-24. El Dorado would take the lead 30-28 right before the half. 
but the dog showed no signs of letting up. After two scores from the Eagles in the third quarter, the game seemed nearly out of reach, kept by the 40-yard run from Elijah Cox to put El Dorado up 45-28. The Bulldogs were down, but not out. A 55-yard TD pass to Molina in the fourth quarter would narrow the gap. 45 seconds later, Bulldog linebacker Gabe Casada intercepted an eagle pass and would once again find the end zone. The Eagles looked to run down the clock until linebacker Daniel Escobedo stripped the ball giving Las Cruces possession and a chance to take the lead. A big catch on third down would put the Dogs in position to score. Peyton Ball would put the team on the one, but a big hit would render the young quarterback out for a bit. Brandon Baeza would step in and had no problem finding his way into the end zone to once again put the Curses up 49-45. The Eagles would find themselves in a fourth and short situation, but the Bulldog defense stopped any chance of a comeback. With a final knee, Las Cruces sealed the deal, putting them 1-0 on the season. Coach Lopez still sees work to be done. You beat a really good football team on the road. You came back and you dealt with adversity, which is all great. But after tomorrow, Phil, it means zero. You get Seville on the ring, and that is it. And I'll say it right now, for the first time out of about 100, Homecoming ain't for you. Yes, Homecoming ain't for you. You got a football game to play. Hey, really, really happy what you did. Listen, I want to start something, all right, tonight, because you guys know how much your parents and your family pour into everything you do, right? Yes, sir. You break it here. I don't care if your family's here or not. I'd like you guys to go over there as a whole team, all right? Yes, it's a family. We're a family. They're a family. Hey, that's why you got those stickers on the back of your helmet, correct? Yes, sir. Great job tonight. Three, two, three.